Hello everybody. Welcome to Paris Pick Grow with Fun and Passion for Kids. Today, I'm going to tell you an amazing story of the two boys. So let's start the story. So there were two boys and they both were playing. They used to they were brothers and they used to play every day and have lot of fun. But one day something surprising happened. The small brother who is a 5 years old and the big brother who is like 8 years old, they both were playing in a forest. And there was a well there. So that time the big brother did not see the well and he accidentally drowned in it. He went inside and he was crying for help. The small brother got very worried, very worried. And so he became a little worried and so then he started to think what he should do. He started to think and think and then he got an idea he took the bucket and he put it down he slowly put it down for his brother to come up and so the brother with the help of that bucket that his small brother put he jumped into that bucket and then somehow the small brother was trying to pull it so that his brother could come up so slowly and slowly and slowly and gradually he did it and now he could come up seeing this big achievement his brother hugged him and after that something more astonishing happened now comes a very nice very amazing part that the now what happened the both the brothers wanted to tell everybody how, how what the achievement was of the small brother he told to everybody the incident but no one believed him thinking that how could a small brother how could a small kid of 5 years can just uh, you know help the big boy who was of 8 years such a big difference everyone thought to like that now there was an old man there was a old man okay so he was known to be very wise so everyone used to agree with him in the village because everyone thought he was very intelligent he was very nice and that's why everyone thought that he we should listen to him so what happened that the villagers told him that the boys were saying this incident and so he did believe him but what the wise man wise old man said that he was believing it now comes the most interesting part when the villagers asked him why he was trusting him old man gave a tremendous reply such a nice reply he told that the small boy could come up could help the little big boy because that time there was no person who could say him that you cannot do it or there was no person who could criticize him at that time and tell him that you uh, you cannot you can't do something everyone was very surprised and now we learn a very interesting thing with the story two parts so there are two moments of the story the first thing is that when the person when you saw the boy the first boy when you saw the boy he loved his brother and if we want something we must never give up then we can do the impossible second thing is when criticism is there most people follow them and give up but the person who knows how to do things how to face criticism is the person 
who can do great things in his life and can achieve the level he wants and that is called what that is called how we can achieve our dreams so try to face criticism because it's the only thing that if you can do it you can achieve the world because many people will come to criticize you but you should not follow the criticism you should work on your own and no one can stop you only you can stop you your mind can stop you try you control your mind so that you can achieve big things in life and then i tell you that you will achieve the best of your life you will become the best version of your life so this is a very important thing you know this also happened with swami vivekananda and he was also uh, i was also inspired by his story so uh, in the uh, youtube i'm going to like post a shot so if you want to watch the swami vivekananda story of uh, when he just became uh, like you know when he just faced criticism but how he handled it was a very amazing part very interesting part that i'm going to tell you in that shot so stay tuned have a great day hope you enjoy it thank you so much for listening to me bye